What's up guys? Welcome to the behind the scenes for Fear Eater. We'll be showing you guys all the behind the scenes stuff. Uh, I was vlogging a little bit while I did it, so please excuse how awkward it is. I've never tried it before, but let's get right into it. So hopefully it'd be cool. I don't know. I've never tried vlogging like this either. Or holding my camera, whatever the fuck this is called. So let me know what you think. But here it is. I went out and I got a bunch of pallets. They've been sitting in my basement, and then we're starting to put it together. So you walk in my basement, you come around, listen to a little wage war, and then we're here. Talking about adding a bunch of different things that I don't want to talk about now in case they don't work out. Um, we're definitely going to paint this bad boy, definitely going to add some more shit, definitely going to add some lights to it, add some fog, and make it nice and dark, then maybe some fun props on top of that. So. Check back in when there is more completed. So day one, you can see this was starting to come together. Pretty much what I did was go out and get the pallets that you saw, and then I put them together on two by fours and stood them up. I built most of it myself, which was a terrible idea. I wish I had had help for some of it. You can slip me along, it was stressful, but it got done. Let's get right into the painting. What's up? We're like two weeks away from actually filming the video, and this is where we're at. So right now I have just about everything built. I have a bunch of shower curtains hanging around because I have someone coming in to paint this today. So my buddy, Young Death, Tom, who's on the song with us, his younger brother does all kinds of painting, makes masks, does a bunch of cool shit. So he is coming over and he's gonna help us paint this. So I'm excited to get that going. I'm gonna put up a few more curtains and then it's go time. I'll show you guys when he gets here. What's up guys? I'm here with Joe. Joe's getting ready to paint. Joe, who are you shouting out today? What's up? I'm from uh, Grave Productions at Instagram, Facebook. Uh, I think those are the only two platforms. Yeah. Instagram, Facebook, Grave Productions. Fucking nailed it, bro. Let's go. <laughs> never did end up coming, which is a bummer, and I don't want to tell you about them because we might use them for another project. But the good news is we did end up getting this thing painted by Grave Productions, and he also was kind enough to let us use one of his masks for the video. Uh, he makes these super cool masks, and check them out, follow him on Instagram, well worth your time. Check out everyone else involved in this project too, I and mean, we got a couple of guitars, we had vocals, we have a behind the scenes photo, we got a bunch of people involved. All their links will be in the description, and this couldn't have happened without them, so please check them out if you enjoy this content, the video, or if you don't care at all, just give them a follow, and that's also great. I didn't really realize that we were only two weeks away from filming until I set it for this video, and I thought about it just now. I still don't know how to play the song yet. I still also don't know how to play guitar, so I gotta learn to fake it again in two weeks. Hopefully that works out. <laughs> In this clip, you see that I say that I don't know the song, I don't know how to play guitar. That's true. I really don't know how to play guitar. I, a couple years ago, learned how to play a couple songs and learned the basics, so I do have some basic skill of it. When you think about what my job is, I'm really just trying to get the best performances out of people at all times. I'm trying to capture them well. I'm observing what looks good and what doesn't look good. So I was able to take all of that information I've collected watching all the bands over the years and kind of put that into myself and try and figure out what I want to do to translate well to camera. So, I don't really know how to play the song, I learn it a little bit, but if you ever saw me play the full thing, if I sat down on the guitar right now and tried to strum through it, it would be hilarious and I would get not through the song. If I was a guitar hero, the crowd would definitely boo me out before I made it to like the second verse. So, whatever. It works in the video though, and for me it's just really fun to be able to pretend to be in a band, right? I mean, I obviously love music if I'm doing all this, but it's never quite been my thing. So to get to pretend to be a rock star for a little bit and be on set is just, it's really fun for me. Yo, so I'm here, we're on set, it's the day of the shoot, and I'm just about ready to go. I'm filming the ceiling, I feel like. Um, we're good, ready to film. Everyone should be here very soon. The set is just about ready. I ordered some things that I'm hoping get here before people get here so I can use them for the shoot. But if not, we're gonna roll with this. I got another scene set up. So I gotta finish clearing out all of this mess. Over here, you can't really see, but if we turn it up a little bit maybe, you can see some of that. Oh well. Ready to go, set is all painted, all red. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. So the shoot went great. We ended up having everyone here. We filmed from like four to about 10 or 11. So it was kind of a long day, but 
everything worked out well. I'm really happy with it all and it was great. I just want to say again, please take a second to check out everyone involved in this project. Young Death is rapping, Mike always has heavy stuff coming out on vocals, Raquel has awesome photos and I'll put some of her behind the scenes work up on screen, maybe over here or over here or maybe I'll just cover my whole safe, safe, oh face, I like face, maybe I'll cover my whole face, I don't know, um, we'll see her photos somehow. Also Chris, Sonar Recordings for producing, mixing and mastering all this, my roommate Chris for hopping in on bass and helping make the video look awesome. Just great, it was awesome all around, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. So if you haven't seen the video already, I will put in a trailer, teaser, something at the end of this video. Please go check it out, otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. When I snap, there's no turning back. Fucking everything around me is fading to black. I can feel it in my night, everything will turn out fine.